Most construction system in the Philippines uses CHB or concrete hollow blocks for perimeter walls and partitions of the building. As per standard, concrete hollow blocks are classified as load-bearing and non-load-bearing blocks. Load-bearing blocks are usually 150 mm in thickness or 6 inches or rarely 200 mm or 8 inches as per ASTM C90 and each block when tested with compressive strength must reach 5.5 MPa or 800 PSI and 6.9 MPa or 1000 PSI on its average compressive strength. However, Non-load-bearing blocks are usually 100 mm thick or 4 inches as per ASTM C129 and has an individual compressive strength of at least 500 PSI or 3.45 MPa and 4.14 MPa or 600 PSI for its average compressive strength. The standard hollow blocks has three void cells and two half cells at both ends, having a total of four. The 4 inches CHB is measured as 10 cm by 20 cm by 40 cm, and each hollow core measures 5 cm by 7.5 cm by 20 cm in height. And these 4 inches CHB are usually used in the interior walls of the building. And 6 inches CHB is measured as 15 cm by 20 cm by 40 cm and usually used in the perimeter walls of the building. CHB laying has two methods, the running band method and the stack band method. Running band method is the most common method nowadays in construction industry in which concrete hollow blocks are staggered. While stack band method is a method in which concrete hollow blocks are laid straight lines. It does not have overlapping units compared to running band. This stack band method is more stronger and durable when strictly implemented due to the continuity of the mortar and the placement of the reinforcing bars which are spaced center to center around 400 mm. While in running band method, the reinforcing bars space at every 600 mm and in every three layers for horizontal rebars as well as in stack band method.
cement mortar is a mixture of cement, sand, and water, and it is used as banding materials in piling concrete hollow blocks or CHB and various plastering works. The delivered unit shall be inspected and should be sound and free of cracks and other defects. For strength, moisture and absorption determination, 6 units shall be selected from each lot of 10,000 units or fraction thereof and 12 units from each lot of more than 10,000 units. And 6 units shall be selected from each 50,000 units or fraction thereof contained in the lot shall be submitted for testing accompanied by a complete field sample card. At time of delivery to the worksite, the unit shall conform to the physical requirements as prescribed.